The F-22 Raptor, a marvel of modern aviation, is widely regarded as one of the most advanced fighter jets in the world. But why can't America build new F-22 Raptors? The answer is complex and involves multiple factors. The F-22 program began in the 1980s, aimed at creating a next-generation air superiority fighter. The first F-22s were delivered to the U.S. Air Force in 2005, showcasing cutting-edge stealth technology, super cruise capability, and unmatched maneuverability. One major reason for stopping production was cost. Each F-22 Raptor had a price tag of around 150 million, making it one of the most expensive fighter jets ever produced. Combined with high operational costs, maintaining a larger fleet would have been financially unsustainable. Another factor was the complexity of restarting production. The F-22 was built using highly specialized techniques and materials, many of which are no longer in production. Restarting the assembly line would require significant investment in re-establishing the supply chain, retraining workers, and updating manufacturing facilities. Additionally, focus had shifted to the F-35 Lightning II program, which promised to deliver a more versatile aircraft at a lower cost. The F-35, designed for multi-role capabilities, was seen as a better investment for the future of U.S. air power. Legislative decisions also played a crucial role. In 2009, Congress voted to end F-22 production, influenced by budget constraints and shifting military priorities. This decision was cemented by the National Defense Authorization Act, which prohibited further procurement of the F-22. Today, the existing fleet of F-22 Raptors continues to serve as a critical component of U.S. air superiority. They undergo regular upgrades to maintain their technological edge, but building new ones remains off the table due to the aforementioned challenges.